Hello. It's time for Neighborhood Community Shoutouts. And it's the night before a turkey day. That's right. So, happy Thanksgiving to all of you out there. Those of you that celebrate Thanksgiving. And I hope whatever you make for your Thanksgiving dinner turns out fabulous. Pizza! <laughs> Uh, just a couple of welcomes. Paul W., welcome to the neighborhood. Family of six, welcome to the neighborhood. And they have a channel, so make sure you go by and check them out. A um, couple of people we haven't heard from in a while. Just want to check in on them. Betsy Wetsy, I hope all is going well with you. Um... I haven't heard from you in a while, and I know you had some medical issues going on, so I want to make sure you're doing okay. So, uh, check in with us. Let us know. Um, still waiting for updates on One Proud Mama 77 on her and Haley both, so uh, keep us updated on how things are going there. Mm -hmm. Sierra Ferguson, thoughts and prayers for her. Um, her mother is healing from a tonsillectomy. Sierra is recovering from her broken foot she got from crashing on her bike. And her little brother is having a hard time with dealing with it all, um, with everything going on. And watching our videos cheers her up when she is feeling down. So, Good. thoughts and prayers go out to you and your family, Sierra, and we're happy that we can cheer you up when you watch our videos. It always makes us happy. So, my question last week was, name three things that you are thankful for. Oosh. Hold on. <laughs> I can do this. Apparently not. We'll be right back. We're having technical difficulties. Okay, so my last week's question was, we're pretending that didn't happen, <laughs> was name three things that you are thankful for. And I chose just a few people to read because most people said the same thing, family, friends, God, YouTube, um, the neighbors. Um, which we're very happy. People are thankful for us, so that makes us thankful. Um, but I chose a few to read that are a little more in detail or a little different. Okay, so the first one I'm going to read is Destiny Swan. Three things I am thankful for are my house, even though it's rented, old and drafty, it's better than living in an apartment. Number two, my beautiful daughter, Ashley, she is the National Honor Society, has been an all-state choir for the past three years and most likely again next year. She will get a four-year plaque for that. She makes me happy and proud to be her mama. Number three, my husband. I am lucky to have someone who loves me as much as he does and to have someone to love. He always supports me in everything I do and always encourages me to do things that scare me, but I am brave enough to try. Very good answers. Tanya Longley. Number one, family and friends. Number two, us finding each other again. Me too. And number three, YouTube for making it possible for me to see you guys every day. And she added a number four. YouTube for making it possible for me to make great new friends with awesome YouTubers such as Mom's Vlog 80, Lucy Owl, Meet the Presleys, Nikki and John, and so on and so forth. Love you all so much. And yes, it was YouTube and uh, Facebook that brought Tanya and I back together again. We grew up together and we had lost contact. so. Um, I'm very thankful for that as well. 
Three things I'm thankful for. One proud mama. My incredible husband of 16 years and my two wonderful, amazing children. My oncologist and doctors catching this cancer and getting on top of things and therefore a second chance at life. My parents, brothers, sisters, nieces, nephews, and mostly you, Kevin, and Megan, and all other YouTubers. Very good answers, and it makes us feel very special to be included in that. Thank you very wow. much, April. Three things I'm great, thankful for, beach-loving Aussie. My loved ones, a second chance at life, and all the people that work tirelessly to make this world a better place. Very good things to be thankful for. Let's see if I can do this without dropping it. Score. <laughs> you need this? Yes. Put my glasses back on because I can't read this without my glasses. <sighs> so, what are three things that you're thankful for? I am thankful that we, after a year, we're still managing to hang on to this house. I'm thankful for my mom for making it possible to be able to hang on to this house. And of course, especially thankful for you to keep me from going completely off the edge <laughs> while almost losing this house during all this. Well, I'm surprised I don't push you off the edge with my attitude sometimes. Sometimes. Today was, a, was an example of which... You promised me. <laughs> I am, this is going to sound very, very strange. I am thankful for my first marriage because I got such a lovely, beautiful, talented, intelligent daughter from my first marriage. I am thankful for my second and final marriage because I got such a an extraordinary, caring, loving, giving, all around perfect husband and man. And I am so thankful to have found him and have him in my life. And I am thankful, and I know this sounds probably very, very horrible to a lot of you. I am thankful that I had this surgery that I had because I am feeling so much better. I am off of medications. My health is getting better. And it's been a long time since I felt this good. And I am thankful for that. Except for when she falls. <laughs> so okay so there you have it okay um my question for tonight that that made me a little teary-eyed sorry guys my question for tonight is what famous person do people tell you that you resemble i was just told i look like norm abrams Refresh my memory. You know I have a bad memory. Who's Norm Abrams? Yankee Workshop. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yes. Yes, you do. Put on a tube belt with nothing in it and you'll be him. So, <laughs> there you have it. What famous person do people tell you that you most resemble? It's time for Neighborhood Community Credit Roll. Okay, so last week the question was about the movie One Dark Night with Meg Tilly, 1982. Um, we actually got to see that. Because yes, thanks to Terry Johnson. Terry Johnson, apparently it's on YouTube. If you can't find the movie, who, uh, just um, look for it on YouTube. It might be there. Uh, I, it's one of the things we don't usually try to look for, but yeah, we watched it. And um, the question was, there was a character named Kitty, and Kitty... Uh, always had a uh, toothbrush in her mouth, which was weird. But uh, why was she named Kitty? And the answer is she was named Kitty for one scene where uh, they're looking for her and they're going, oh, they're looking, Kitty, Kitty. 
Here, kitty, Here, kitty. kitty. Don't do that, but it's the idea. And uh, it was for a jump scare. So while you're laughing and, and uh, at the situation, then there's a jump scare. So that is why they actually named the character that just for one short team. So, and the people who got that correct was Terry Johnson, The Abyss 9282, and Tanya Longley. Woohoo! Now, today I was looking high and low for a Thanksgiving movie. And boy, oh boy, was that hard to find. I found a couple of uh, real turkeys hard to find. <laughs> uh, one was called Thanks, Thanks Killing, which was 2013, and it was really awful. We actually tried watching it just earlier today. And it was one of those uh, student films with a budget of $3,500. I, I would not recommend it. Uh, it was this kind of grindhouse kind of stuff. The other one was called Blood Feast. And a guy wanders around with a paper mache turkey head on killing people. Oh my goodness. 1972. But I discovered a movie that was set at Thanksgiving time that um, is a comedy, kind of a horror. And that would be the Adams Family Values. I don't know if you ah, remember. Ah, yes, yes. There's this whole scene where they're they're acting out the uh, Pilgrim's Landing or whatever. Yes. But the question is, in that movie, what does Lurch play on the on the accordion for at Fester's wedding? That's the question. There you have it, guys. You're trivia question and your question of the day. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you out there. We would not be here today if it weren't for all of you out there watching us. We love you all. I can make a better heart with this cast. We love you all very, very much. It's her black heart, though. <laughs> Thumbs up. Make sure you go by and check out all our other stuff. And... We will see you guys next week.